Okay, Jeff. So uh, this is the first video that I mentioned I will make for you. So you see here that there are a total of 3150, 3,150 wineries in California. One thousand seven hundred and thirty five wineries are in northern six twenty five are in southern and the rest are located in Central Valley. What fraction of California wineries are located in Central Valley? OK, so the Central Valley number we're not given. So that's what the question is. And so, you know, um, my goal is always to get us to start with the question. So we're going to ID the question. And we're going to say, uh, you know, Central Valley. CV. Okay. Then the next thing we're going to do is we get, we have to break this down. So if we know there's 3,150 total, and then if we know that the Northern is 1735, and we know the Southern is 625, we can add those together. So that's 10, 5, 6, 13, um, 23, 60, okay? So we can add those together and then subtract those from the total. And then whatever is left... has to be the Central Valley wineries, okay? The number of Central Valley wineries. So that's, of course, zero. We're going to borrow from the two. That's going to be 11, but we're going to have to borrow from that, so that becomes 10. Then we're going to 15. So 15 minus 6 is 9. And then 10 minus 3 is 790, okay? Um, so, <clears throat> so we have 790 Central Valley wineries. Now you can do that because now the fraction says what fraction of California wineries are located in the Central Valley. So you're going to put Central Valley up top and California as a whole on the bottom. And so now you have that number, Central Valley, and you have that number for total California, so now you simply make a fraction, 790, sorry for my pen, it's a little bit slow this morning, 790 over 3,150, okay? And I'll let you reduce that and do the math on that. But that's the first one that can help you out. Um, if you have any further questions on that, get back with me. But again, just to review the concept here, is when you know the total and you have some pieces, the northern and the southern, you can add the northern and the southern, like what we did here, and subtract it from the total to get the missing value. And the missing value here is Central Valley. And then to set up your fraction, you just put the Central Valley number over the total California number. Hope that helps, Jeff.